What's up, guys? I'm a Blooming guy, and this is some Mind Warfare 3. Now, I'm playing Team Tactical with a couple of my friends. You know, we just decided why not? Because the main Team Deathmatch and Domination perspective was getting a little too campy. So, you know, we were like, well, we could just take it lower. And this is what we have. Um, as you can see, a lot of people are really concentrating on one area and are missing very badly here so I was like hmm, how do I lure him here and then and of course he does not take the bait I see bullets over there I'm like wait a minute and I can't tell if he's camping or if he's getting cover who knows and I have a predator missile on team tactical which doesn't mean much cause you get one kill two kills never mind and basically the entire match is just us my team, my friends, just doing what we can. This, team, this is basically, it's very small. It's it spawns. I mean, I don't know how to describe Team Tactical. I mean, to me, Team Tactical is basically you play when you know for a fact regular Dom, Ground War, or everything is just making you mad. And you know, not, not that many good people come to Team Tactical, especially when you have a lot of good Call of Duty players as friends. Well, you know, not much camping, not much to do. I gotta say though, Team Tactical is very, very chill. I mean, it's not that much running around, but not that much camping, it's not that much stress. The most I think you could worry about is... Hmm. You don't really worry about mobs being done. I mean, you can get one if it's possible. You just don't have to worry about that much. When it comes to like the playlists, I wouldn't play Team Tax Search and Destroy. Because things get a little real. Because there's only so many people on each side. Capture the flag to me though is hilarious because it was just like this. We had a play we were playing Team Tactical, like now. And I don't know if I recorded it or not, but the entirety of the match is started. It was like, I think, 10 minutes left. I mean, it was just 10 minutes right off the bat. My friend went to get the flag, he came back, nothing happened. So I was like, okay, let me try the same thing. Got the flag, came back, nothing happened. Nobody got any kills. At all. It was just point A, point B, done. And then, tried the same thing again, to see if we could get any kills. I got like three kills, and after that, we just dominate there was no point <laughs> see the point of team tactical is you actually have to play as a team with domination ground war and all that stuff you you're on your own but it's good to play as a team but team tactical it determines how much of a team player you are well in my perspective you know some people might think it's just stupid playlist me it's pretty chill now, a quick tip about Team Tactical. Well, it's kind of like the same thing. When you play Team Tactical, make sure you have a good weapon. Um, for regular domination, I believe... Oh, man. Somebody left. Somebody left. Yep. Alright. Okay. But like I was saying... Well, Sandy Rabbit gave a tip once. He said, if you want to have fun with Call of Duty, have maximum three people with you playing. Because an entire team on regular Dom or Ground War is just tedious and gets boring fast. For Team Tactical, you need to have an entire full party to enjoy it. You know, everyone has their own thing going on. It's very, you know, Oh, come on. I mean, it's very... It's a small, you know, map. It's a small amount of people, small amount of stuff you have to deal with. So, yeah. When you play with a full party in Dom, he's right. It does tend to get boring sometimes and tedious. Like, you guys are winning a lot. You guys got a mode. You guys got all your kill streaks. You don't know what to do next. You're like, oh, man, that's good. For Ground War, I think it'd be easier to go with, like... Full party that amounts to Dom. 
or at least maybe five people. Because then you know for a fact there's going to be a lot of other people, green guys, fiends, stuff like that. And I know a lot of people, you know, have a certain play type, have a certain favorite match, domination, the ground, team deathmatch, search and destroy. A lot of people have their favorite playlists. I wouldn't say Team Tactical is my favorite playlist, but it's one of the top five. Because one match type I know I enjoyed playing a lot was Hardcore, because, well, it's basically like Modern Warfare 2. You know, everyone has stopping power, stuff like that, but... Because sometimes, though, it gets way too campy, and you know, I have to leave. So, but it's still a really good one. Um, I play hardcore, I usually go with free for all, team deathmatch, kill confirm one or the other. As long as you try and do what you have to do to enjoy this game, you know, you know with all its flaws and you know, cheap players, it's still a pretty decent game overall. It's just sometimes the players, you know, do that rage quit moment. Like that. Well guys, hope you enjoyed the match, and I will catch you later.